I am Janelle, the creator of Work & Co. Welcome back to my channel, and if you're new here, thanks for finding me. So recently, Ari had a fantastic sale, and I thought I would take advantage of it. So a few of these items are going to be first impression, and a few of them I actually knew I was keeping 110% so I actually did something different. I washed a few of them. I wanted to see how they fit afterwards, how they washed and what I could recommend to you. I think a lot of try on videos are fantastic and they help to show the fit of the clothing but one thing for myself being that I am a little bit curvier or a more plus size I do find some clothes shrink when I do wash them even if I do take the best care and there's nothing more frustrating than buying a shirt or buying a pair of pants that fit you really well when you first buy them and as soon as you wash them you can't wear them anymore because they're just a little bit too short or they've stretched out weird or something's happened and you've spent that money on this clothing that you were hoping were gonna last and they did not I am happy to say that a lot of the clothing I have purchased from Airy, I haven't had very many issues with as far as uh, washing goes which is a really good thing to hear uh, I think that just speaks volumes to the quality that they put out as there is a lot of clothing retailers out there that do sell product that definitely don't last longer than one wear and I think in a world where a lot of us buy and own more things than we should. I think if we are trying to buy quality products that will at least last us a long time, I think that's really important. If you like YouTube, I'm sure you've seen a lot of thrifting videos and I've never really had a lot of luck with thrifting as far as clothing goes, mainly because I do live in a smaller city and because of my size. When I do go to different centers to take a look at clothes that they have, I find that the sizes just don't fit me properly, mostly because maybe the products have been washed and they're misshapen and for me, I have a long torso and I'm taller and things just need to fit me properly so I just get really frustrated and unfortunately you won't probably see any thrifted clothing hauls on here but I do really like to be mindful in the places that I do purchase from as well as the items that I do buy. So I should let you know too that I have recently partnered up with Aries and I wanted to be able to showcase a few of the amazing items that I was gifted by them because they are just too great not to talk about and just Aerie in general is just such an amazing company as far as their marketing strategies, their social media, and just the way, just the way that they radiate positive vibes and body inclusivity and just everything like that. I think in a time like now, we need more of that more than ever. So without further ado, because I could probably sit here and talk nonsense to you forever. Let's get this airy try-on haul started. So here we have an oversized boyfriend v-neck tee. I got this one in a large and I also got an extra large because I wasn't sure how oversized it was going to be. And this one is a large and I find that it fits very nicely. Just the right fit. The v-neck is nice as well. It doesn't go down too low, but just enough to kind of give you a little bit of a variation. And it does have on the edges of the shirt as well as the neckline there. I decided to pair this with these really cute paper bag shorts. I saw these and I had to have them. I tried them on in an airy store a couple months ago and they only had up to an extra large, but they definitely did not fit me. So when I seen that they had these in the extra extra large I definitely grab had to grab them and of course they fit perfectly so this pair here I actually did wash last night so I washed old with detergent and fabric softener and then I hung them to dry and to be quite honest I think they washed quite well I maybe could have ironed or steamed them out a little bit to get some of the wrinkles out um, but I don't feel like they've shrunk or misshapen at all. They're quite nice. They have the elastic waistband as well as a tie here. Make sure when you are washing them to remove this uh, that I completely forgot about. They have nice deep pockets and I think they will just be a perfect short to wear during the summer. Not tight and nice loose fitting perfect with a tucked in t-shirt or tank top. I think this is definitely a summer staple for sure. All right, so when I seen this really cute oversized long sleeve tee, I knew I needed it. 
in my life. I love to wear oversized tops and they're even better when they actually have tight arms. I think that just looks so much more flattering. And this is super lightweight, so it's perfect for summer, for a summer night even, to pair with your shorts. And it is oversized like this, but I think it'd be super cute to do a little front French tuck if done properly. <laughs> not the front as well like this shirt is amazing uh, this is an extra large I would like to try it in a large because it is just a little bit oversized like too oversized for me and it's really cute actually because in the sleeves they have holes for your thumb so that's kind of cool this was one of the tops I knew I was keeping as well so I did wash it last night and actually this one arm is still wet so I washed it cold and hung to dry obviously I didn't lay it evenly out but it does seem to have kept its shape really well. I washed it cold with detergent as well as fabric softener and it seemed to hold up quite well. This shirt also would be really great for any new moms or nursing moms as these snaps do work as well. So overall I'm really happy with this top and I think it is super cute for summer. So with doing these try-ons, I also wanna make sure that I'm showing you the good and the bad. And so this, these pants are an example of the bad. Wanted these ones in the jean, but they were all sold out. So I thought these would be another nice colored option as I really like neutrals. Uh, I think these would have been super cute if they were in my size, like the extra large, but unfortunately they are just much, much too big. So these would definitely be true to size, whereas the paper bag shorts would, you would want to upsize a little bit. So this is one of Aerie's Real Me wireless bras as well. Uh, this is absolutely amazing and I think everybody needs to own one of these. They're so comfortable. I love the color and the material that they picked. It's kind of like a ribbed material and this color is just spot on. It is perfect for those lazy days at home, which we are all doing right now. It's perfect for those underneath those oversized sweaters that Aerie is always known for. And I think this is just like, it is a must have. It comes in a few different colors and it is just so comfortable. If you love wearing sports bras, this is a nice light support option to wear around the house when you aren't working out. It is just so comfortable and I absolutely love it. All right, so as I talked about with the previous top, I mentioned how much I absolutely love this terracotta color. So I definitely wanted to give this top a try. I didn't actually realized that it was a crop top even though I do like to you know knot things or front tuck things I like to have the option to also have it long as well so I'm not really sure how I feel about this top it does kind of go from higher to low which is nice if you are tucking in because you'll feel like it's fuller length in the back but for myself I don't know I love this color and I love the little worn out distressed details that they have on it and it is just so soft the inside isn't a uh, fleece which is nice so it's perfect for summer but because it's a crop top I don't know if I will keep it so we should probably talk about the jeans that I'm wearing. These are a uh, mom jean and they're actually Kirby. They are a size 16 and I have been wearing these actually for a couple days. I did need a new pair of jeans and so one of my go-to places for jeans is American Eagle and I wanted to try out the Kirby as well as I have a pair that I'll show you that's just a regular uh, mom jean as well but I did find that I was liking the curvy one a little bit more. There is a little bit of a stretch in them, as you can see. I'm not super, super curvy, more so up here and not really in the hips, so there is quite a bit of extra fabric on the sides that at least makes them really comfortable to wear. I really like the little bit of distress that they have as well as kind of the retro like acid light wash look. I don't have any pairs like that so I thought this pair was really cute. So when I first tried them on they were quite tight and not forgiving but like with most jeans as you wear them they do start to give a little bit and I have been wearing these ones non-stop for quite a few days. We're not going to talk about that but I find that they're quite comfortable now and I am really liking how high they are going up. Okay, so these jeans here are the mom jeans and they're not curvy. 
they are high waisted but I find that they don't go up quite as high as the curvy ones do. It's not really obvious to me a huge difference between them aside from the other ones being a little bit higher which could just be because I'm not super curvy and these ones these ones seem to be a little bit lower there isn't as much fabric in the thighs but for me I don't carry my weight down here I carry it all right here so even though those ones do go up higher because I don't have the hips to fill them out it did feel more comfortable to me I just felt like the other ones fit a little bit better these ones I think were a little bit more looser back here so I don't know about you guys, but I love all of Aries crew neck sweatshirts. Um, when I seen this one, I had to have it because I definitely like a good dark gray option in my closet. This is really cute because it does have the slits on this side, so it's nice because it just kind of breaks up how oversized everything is. Again, really cute to do kind of like the front tuck if you wanted. It gives you a longer back. It's a really nice kind of like like a little kind of like a corded material it's super soft it's not fleece so it's perfect for summer it is just so cozy i just absolutely love it this also was one of the pieces that i washed as well and sometimes after push after your first wash you can get some pilling going on but i don't see any of that on here which is great a little fuzz i did already drop some makeup on it and it's kind of stuck in there but that's my own fault. This is an extra large but I like how I can knot it and it gives me that amount of loose flowiness but also accentuates the smallest part of me which is my natural waist and it does have the long sleeves but like I said I like to have them rolled up. I really like this because it kind of has that vintage vibe as well as a little bit of distressing along the edges. I think this is super cute, lightweight, and perfect for summer. Now, this wouldn't be an airy try-on if I didn't try on a bathing suit because their bathing suits are the best. This one is adorable because of the ruffles. It has the two adjustable straps in the back, and I really like this extra band. So one of the cool things that I really liked about these bathing suits, because I have one more that I'm going to show you, is that they're actually made out of uh, recycled fibers from plastic bottles, which I think is really cool. I think that it's really great when different companies are being a little bit more mindful when it comes to materials or fibers that they are using. And it just makes you feel better because you're wearing something that is, you know, makes you feel good and you're radiating positivity and you're also helping the environment, which I think is fantastic. Okay, and last but not least, we have have this really cute bandeau bathing suit. I personally really love bandeaus because I like the option of being able to fade out some of those nasty tan lines that you get with a little bit more of a strappier piece and if you don't like the bandeaus or you like to switch on and off it does come with two straps that go around to the back so it's not a halter which is nice and the straps are both adjustable as well as removable so you it's kind of like you have two bathing suits in one it just has the clasp in the back as well as these are the high waist cheekies that I have definitely come to love. I think I have like three or four pairs now. <laughs> I don't know where I'm going with them, but I have a lot of bathing suits. All right, so that is everything. I hope you guys enjoyed that video of my airy try-on haul. If there is any other companies or any other types of products that you would like me to try out for you, definitely let me know in the comments below. Make sure to like the video if you enjoyed yourselves and hit the subscribe button so you don't miss out on any of my videos. Thanks so much for watching. Bye!